Alright, this is uh, a 3D printer, as Justin said, and I named it Genesis because it's my first one, and the company name's Creator. Uh, I saw the design on the internet, obviously, or actually I read it in Woodshop, and I decided to build one from scratch. Uh, mine's quite significantly larger than any of the ones that I've seen on That's the That's how you made the pieces. Made all the pieces on our other CNC machine on the router, and I designed them all from scratch. It took that that took what the majority of the time was to design all the pieces. And here I can jog the thing around. So works like the other CNC machine. You know, you got the same basic controls, and all the axis is. I don't know, I just had a good time. I just saw the design, thought it'd be fun to do, and started working on it. Run through a couple of parts for us that you built, especially the ones with the bearings in. I, um, here. One of my favorite things that I had to build was this axis, because it took a long time to figure out how I was going to cause it to stay both sideways and uh, front and backwards so it doesn't jerk around and screw up my print. So I didn't have much room and these arms on the back, I had to cut out the arms to the right size so that they were just the right length that I still have maximum height and the spring can still hold them together without pulling too far apart. And it took me almost three weeks just to figure out this part and how to do this. And then my most favorite part on this machine is the gantry. The gantry took probably a month just to figure out how to make it work properly without having it jerk around too much. Because, you know, all the designs I saw, there was no gantry, just a bottom plate moving back and forth. So I had to figure out, design, and manufacture my gantry.